Hello, this is Captain Paxo doing a post commentary, or back doing post commentaries this time, because live commentaries, they're absolutely not my thing. I'll try them every now and again uh, when I feel like it, um, but more often than not, these Titanfall videos are going to be post commentaries because, God, I, f I find them so hard to do. Like, just playing and trying to talk at the same time, they're two things that just don't really work. They don't mesh well in my brain all that often. There are some times where I'm in a bit of a, a trance, so to speak, I'm sort of autopiloting on the game, um, and then I can do a bit of a live commentary, but that, that's, that doesn't happen too often when I'm playing, unfortunately. And this, the game you're watching right now is actually one of those instances where I was kind of autopiloting and I was doing decently well. Um, so, you know, it's really difficult to tell when I'm going to be like that and when I'm not going to be like that, you know? Uh, but speaking of this game, um, and the reason why it wasn't a live commentary, uh, was because I was kind of ill when I was playing this, uh, which is kind of why I'm using the alternator and tone as my titan, because uh, I was like, yeah, I'm feeling really kind of ill right now, I just want to play some Titanfall, and I, I, I want to do something that doesn't really require me to think. Because <laughs> it is kind of, it is quite simple to use the alternator and tone. They're not exactly difficult things to use, are they? I mean, if, when you put them on, though, you're not guaranteed to do well. You know, you have to be a good player to use them. But it's a lot easier to use Tone than it is most of the other Titans in the game. And I know Ion is, like, meant to be a lot better now than Tone. But Tone's still really, really good. Um, but yeah, so I was kind of ill when I was playing this. And I was also talking to a friend of mine at the time. So, you know, it is what it is. I'll try and get uh, another live commentary some point in the future. When that'll be, I don't know. Nobody knows. But yeah, tone. <laughs> Not something I use all that often. I mean, my tone is like level 14. Not even regenerated, just level 14. <laughs> this goes to show how little I've used her. And some people have got her to gen 10 and I'm just sat here it's level 14, haven't even regenerated yet. You know. But yeah. I'm really not liking this pink camo on my alternator. I mean, I kind of put it on because it's one of those ridiculous things where it's like, hey, sure, why not? You know. But then I get in game and it's just sort of like, this looks hideous. I wish I didn't put it on. <laughs> so. Next time I use this weapon, I'm definitely going to have to take that off. I'm standing on a titan. That's something that doesn't happen all that often. So yeah. Oh, I forgot to mention. Like, another couple of reasons why live comms probably not going to be um, too common is they're kind of awkward to set up with the system, the recording system that I do. Because I record all this gameplay through the share function on the PlayStation, which I really do not recommend to anyone. Um, but so in order for me to do live commentaries, I have to fiddle around with some settings with the the share function, like uh, record um, microphone audio uh, in gameplay clips, and then you know I just, I just put myself into a party so that other people can't hear me blabbing on about whatever it is I'm blabbing on about and then I can't hear them telling me to shut the fuck up, you know? Um, but then when I do that, I can't balance the audio very easily. It's like I have to um, go into the game and lower the sound as opposed to having two audio tracks, which I have now. Like I have the, um, the game audio and my uh, commentary audio and I can increase one, decrease the other, sort of bounce them out like that. With the live commentaries, they're just one audio track. I can't split them. They're, just, they're one and the same. They're together. They're mixed. So that can make it a little bit interesting when trying to 
um, like balance the game audio because I have to I have to fiddle around with some settings with just the game audio and seeing like is this loud enough to be able to hear is it overpowering my voice is it too quiet mm, you know so that that can that can be a little bit awkward but generally I only have to do that like once uh, every time uh, I want to do a live com on a game so that's again not too awkward the main thing is the um, the fact that the share factory sometimes will cut out a random five seconds of footage in your uh, clips and I've talked about this before in a previous video but I think it's to do with uh, notifications like when you get a notification it cuts the five seconds where your notification would pop up which is retarded on multiple levels but that's that's the way that I think it works because I, I don't have any other explanation and whenever that happens it's incredibly disheartening especially if say I get in a really good mindset I get a really good live commentary and then oh there's a five second cut in the middle of that was completely out of my control I just sort of think to myself like I don't want to do this anymore because that that's incredibly frustrating when when you do something incredible and you want to share it but then you have like a five second cut somewhere in the middle of it and it just ruins the whole video I mean with a uh, post commentary it's not too bad because I can like talk around it I can go oh this is like what happened you know but with a live commentary that's like five seconds um, out of your live com because the two tracks are one and the same you know so a sentence will start and then it'll cut and then I'll be t with another sentence you know you'll just miss out of like five seconds of commentary and I could have been talking about something really important or really interesting and oh that's lost forever you know and I could, I could um like do post com after that um but like I said the two tracks are one and the same so it'd mean that the game volume would have to go down to zero so it, it would just be mute and that's not the end of the world you know I could still do that it's just there are a lot of things going against doing a live commentary for me um and that's not to say that I'll never do it you know I will I'll try every now and again um but I gotta be honest I'm not really playing too much Titanfall I'm playing a decent amount but I don't know not as, not as much as I used to like I'll still get on like every uh, couple of days or so play a game um, but part of it is like whenever I get on I'm using the Cold War and I've gotten to the point with the Cold War where I actually do I do well consistently like I I consistently drop 20 kills in attrition when I'm using the Cold War and it kind of feels like okay just just sort of going through the motions a little bit and that's not necessarily bad you know it's it's kind of I feel like I've gotten to a point where I'm actually really good with the Cold War because the Cold War is not an easy weapon to use uh, you know but getting to the point where I am uh, good with it it feels good you know but the the sense of like challenge and excitement when I get a good gameplay is kind of kind of disappeared a little bit so I need to mess around with some other weapons some other uh, setups just to like challenge myself so once again if you have any sort of setup that you'd like to see me try and use even if it's just a really stupid setup put it in the comments and I'll give it a go you know why not right something to do something could be fun let's do it right um or maybe I just need to try out some different game modes I don't know but I recently got uh, Titanfall on PC and that has been a lot of fun because my aim is horrendous and it's hilarious <laughs> and I'm hitting all the wrong keys because I'm not used to what buttons I'm meant to be pressing to activate what abilities and it's just it's just hilarious I'm so bad <laughs> 
<laughs> like, I'm having a gunfight the <laughs> with someone. We're all jumping around each other, and we're just spraying, like, three clips at each other, completely missing. <laughs> and it's just sort of like, oh my god. God, <laughs> when I eventually killed him, I'm like, I really hope he doesn't watch that kill cam because I spent about three hours trying to shoot at him and I just couldn't hit him because my own shit. <laughs> oh God, but I'll get there. You know, I'll eventually get to the point where I'm I'm pretty comfortable with the aim on PC, and it's it's a whole new experience. I actually recorded my first um, game on PC, so hopefully I can. Uh, commentate that, and that'll be that'll be hilarious, dude. <laughs> It'll just be so funny. Like, I'm trying to hit him. I'm trying to hit him. I can't hit him. My aim shit. <laughs> oh, good times. But this game is slowly coming to a close, and as you can see with like the 30 second timer, and I didn't actually realize that. Uh, is this the game where we went into sudden death? I think this is the game where we went into sudden death. I can't remember. <laughs> and I look at the kill, I look at the scoreboard, I'm like, holy shit, 30 kills? What? Because <laughs> like I said, I was kind of ill, I was in a bit of a feverish daze, I wasn't really paying attention, I was talking to my friend, and I look at the the uh, the scoreboard and I'm like, holy shit, 30 kills? What? <laughs> How did I manage that? Where did that come from? Uh, Pro tip, get in a feverish days and you'll be amazing. <laughs> it's why Game Sage is so good, he's always ill. <laughs> uh, but yeah, we're now in sudden death and I didn't actually realise that, I don't think. I don't know. No, I probably didn't. Maybe I did. No? What am I talking about? It's not even sudden death, it's 3 <laughs> What am I talking about? I'm in a feverish days right now! <laughs> we got three flag caps, there's zero. Oh my god. Oh. What am I talking about? I think the last video that I commentated, um, it went into sudden death, and it was on this map, and I didn't realise that we were in sudden death. So, it's probably that. Like, I, I got confused. <laughs> Please don't hate me. <laughs> God damn. But yeah, kind of went on a wrecking spree in this free feverish days of mine. So uh, yeah, thank you very much for watching, <laughs> and I'll catch you next time, where I'm hopefully talking a little bit more sense.